apparently, there are so many women who are unable to interpret the emotions of the men they're with <laughs> that there's a new term for it. It's called hermeneutic labor. Hermeneutic. Yeah. That's what it supposedly means now, and it's the process of trying to decipher how a man is really feeling emotionally, because <laughs> no point in just asking them. <laughs> <laughs> but, but what if you ask them and thoughts? they just, like, you still don't understand it? Go on with your business. I spent years <laughs> of my 20s trying to interpret what men meant, and then I met my husband, who's actually a good communicator, and realized that maybe just those men were being, like, difficult and mm -hmm. not communicating and not telling what they actually feel because they didn't care enough to. So my advice, mm -hmm. marry a good communicator. Well, I also learned yeah. you can communicating with different energies, so you, made ima you might imagine, knowing me here, that I'm a high-energy communicator. <laughs> Lots of hands and emotion. <laughs> and caffeine. That, too. A but lot of caffeine Max in the is really here, and I realize we do our best communicating if I can just bring myself down to here, and I can say the same exact thing things, but if I don't spark that, oh my God, here she goes, he stays, mm -hmm. he stays. You hit a high pitch, they're out. The problem is that yeah. it's hard to really uh, access their inner life because they're, they're not really so uh, effusive about how it feels. Exactly. And, you know, we're, we're also attracted to the strong, silent type. And they've kept yes. it going, I think, you know? Yes. It's hard to access. They don't want to talk the way women do. Then well, why are you spending needs. all that time trying to find out what's going on we're, with it? Go on we're about not. your business. We're not well, really spending I, I want to know. I, I don't know. You know what? If I ask you what's wrong, you tell me nothing. Facts. I'm out. <laughs>